Hello folks and welcome back to Let's Rumble as well as Plain Terraria. I'm your host the Gamer Darius. So uh, we covered quite a bit last time it was a little bit of a constant search for more you know uh, for turtle shells. It wasn't that bad really it wasn't it wasn't terrible. Okay it was pretty bad but regardless Today we're actually going to have a little bit of progress in the way of, uh, well, badassitude. Why? Well, because if my luck holds up, then down here I have actually built an arena, which is more or less just a huge open space to fight Plantera. And then after we go defeat Plantera, we're going to move on to the dungeon. Where I plan to farm myself some, uh, a new weapon. Yes, I forget the name of it at the top of my head. But regardless, let's fight ourselves a giant plant. Where is it coming from? It's coming from right there. Be coming from that way. Oh yeah, the fight begins. It's probably going to be... Anticlimactic, just so you guys know. Um, look at him. Look at him. He's a pansy. He's a planty pansy. Now, I probably should have made the entirety of the ground area here out of uh, planks because those pink spiky balls that he's tossing out only come out and bounce off of. Yeah, solid parts. Alright, so we're halfway through. Yeah. He shoots spines at you, which is alright. He shoots these flowers at you, which is alright. The part that sucks, for most melee people anyways, is the fact that he kind of explodes into those ever so many plants. Yeah. Get a rest down here. Oh, no rest for the wicked. Yeah. Come on! Now I've not fought this guy with. Ah, yes! Whew! Alright. So he drops the, jump, the temple key, which we will need to use in order to get into the temple. But we're not going there yet. No, sir. Although we are pulling out the hollowed key because. I had actually found the hollow key while just exploring around here and making my dungeon. Or, making my dungeon. Making my arena for fighting him. So, okay. Over here, really quickly, I have built a little house which the uh, fungus guy is going to move into. Once everything around here is all fungusified, though. It's going to take a little bit. Because everything needs to be fungusified, and then you'll know it's fungusified when it has, you know, the blue stuff has completely circumvented that area. Also, I made his house out of purple. Ah, the cyborg's moved in. Cyborg doesn't have any, anything of value for us, though. Oh, so I finally went down into the underworld. And got the tax collector Woodrow. Uh, pretty much you can come speak to him and he collects taxes from the other NPCs. The more, let's see, it was the more NPCs that you have, the more taxes he collects. Taxes he collects. I can English. Alright, so now that, that that's out of the way, we're going to quickly sell some stuff. Oh, I made some... I bought some pumpkin seeds from the Dryad, so as I can get a little bit of pumpkin pumpkin motif going on. Yeah. I think my Let's Play juice is a running a little low today, because earlier today I had finished recording uh, another Let's Play. So, yeah. If I'm sounding like a nut, that's probably why. So anyways, let's go to the dungeon. 
I'm flying away. Hey, there it is. Alright, so what we're doing in the dungeon, besides putting away anything that might be of value later on, what we're doing in the dungeon, besides gathering the one item from the hollow, uh, from the hollowed chest, which is a thing we're going to totally get, which, because I think it's like right here, we're actually going to be fighting and hoping that one of the monsters that we encounter is going to drop. Ooh, sweet, it's right there. Ah, yes, the rainbow gun. Also, going to collect the chest. Now we're going to help. Yeah, hope that the that we're going to be fortunate enough to actually get ourselves one of the other yo-yos. Right. All right, and this is the rainbow gun. Pretty interesting, huh? But yeah, uh, the next weapon in our arsenal is only after the Plantera had been slain, which makes sense. We slew the Plantera. So now we go down. Now the only- now I get the Shadow Beam Staff! Damn it all the hell again. Uh, go figure. Ooh, I'm actually gonna grab that. The Screamer. We'll put it in someone's house. Whoa! Eh? No? Okay. Now, the only thing that sucks about the dungeon is everything is now more powerful. Well, less everything is now more powerful and more... Everything's more ready to kill you, despite the fact that you have some totally bitching armor. See that guy? He's bone me. See? Get it? Ah! <laughs> Someone doesn't appreciate the uh, good puns, despite the fact that they're the focus of the pun. Uh, so pretty much you want to- Oh, hello. So pretty much you want to find an area that makes it so as you don't die so easy. This is a little difficult, seeing as most these- uh, most of the spellcasting guys will teleport around or do massive amounts of damage. So we want to try to avoid mostly those guys. Wait, are you serious? Are you super serial serious right now? Eh, oh well. Boom! The eye sees the end. That's a new painting. Might as well get this one too. Alright, so yeah, we just want to find a spot that is easiest and safest for us to uh, get ourselves the equipment that we want. Why not collect that one? I'm a bit of a painting collector. Now, usually what I would end up doing is pre-dungeon, or pre-plantera, come into here and make myself a nice arena where with which that I can just make a place that is suitable to be slaying the many monsters and creatures until I get myself the stuff that I need. However, that's boring when you're trying to do it as a let's play. So, uh, how long have I been going? Only 10 minutes? That's not bad. So, more or less, you just need to find a safer place to do it. So you don't end up dying. Yeeha! What's also kind of cool about the acid trip uh, die that I have. Yeah, there we go. The acid trip die that I have, it illuminates itself when it's in complete and total darkness, so... You can actually partially see yourself. Oh, a sniper. Oh, shoot. I did not see my HP. 
Apparently it was rather low. Whoa. Oh, you die. You die. Right. There we go. Ah, I hate being slowed by the necromancers. Oh, hey. I will gladly take myself the... Another angel statue. I need it for my house to make it look pretty. I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts, tilly dee, there they are, standing in a row. Big one, small one, some as big as a head. Give them a twist, a flick of the wrist, that's what the showman said. Yeah, okay. Whoa, someone's got a shotgun. Damn. They're really coming out in droves now. Man, I really don't. I really, really hope that it's not going to be as ludicrous as getting myself the. Oh shit! Oh come on! Well, this has turned into a land of nope. Yeah. Do I not have my? I don't. I don't have it equipped. God damn it. You know what? Survival over damage right now. Whew. That was close. Way too close. Come on, one of you just give me the yo-yo already. It'd be really, really nice. Yo yo, yo yo, yo yo, yo 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 yo. I'm saying, what comes from grinding? Ah! Ectoplasm. Been slimed. Ah, Jesus! Am I hitting hit by a sniper? Oh, I'm gonna hide. Don't you dare. No. Bad touch. No touchy. No touchy. Ah! Ha! Fool! Can't reach me. Oh. I think I just screwed myself. Door, 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 door. Whoa! Oh. Did I accidentally use my staff? Eat yo-yo! Eat cheap yo-yos! Oh my god. That was way too close. Yeah, I ended up using the Shadow Beam staff. Which is all well and good, but I am trying to kill things primarily. Ah! Uh, I was I was about to say kill things primarily using the uh a yo-yo weapon, but that is turning out to be old. I dead. Apparently, the ectoplasm can be really useful for some armors and whatnot. But again, I'm going with the tur with the uh, beetle armor when it finally comes to that point. Oh hey, the truffle moved in finally. That's cool. Uh, don't really know why we got the truffle. We just got the truffle. I can talk. Weird achievement name. Of course you can talk. You're a truffle. Truffles talk. You just need to silence them before eating them. Whoa, did I say that out loud? More ectoplasm. Where's the Ghostbusters when we need them? And I mean the classic ones. I'm sorry, it's not a thing against the all-female cast. I just dislike the... <sighs> I just dislike two of the quote-unquote comedians that they have playing in it. They're not funny. They're just not. It's like stupid humor. 
dislike him. Whoa, don't hurt me. All right, I take it back. Take it back. Just stop trying to kill me. I'm not taking it back. Ah, oh, not the time to spawn in front of me, dude. I'm trying to adjust myself on my chair. Oh, I got the key brand. I wonder how that is in 1.3. Eh, actually, it's still pretty bad. Which sucks because I love the game that it's based off of. Yeah, it's still pretty bad. Especially for this late in the game. This late in the game, you have yourself like swords that shoot projectiles and are awesome. And the key brand here just. Nothing. It doesn't do anything overly special. It just looks cool. I'm pretty sure they just put it in as a reference to Kingdom Hearts. Don't get me wrong, I can't blame them, but at the same time, come on. Ah, go away, Bone Leaf. Uh, this is starting to hurt. Did I end up picking up that gold? I must have. Okay, slight change in plans. I'm going to go ahead and... <gasps> it's the Paladin! Oh, he hurts like a tank! <sighs> go away, go away. I'm going to get a hammer right to the back of the skull if I'm not careful. Alright. So he'll keep on coming at you. No matter what. So you just want to keep on hitting him. Because the longer that you hit him, the longer he'll go without throwing his hammer. Ooh! Ooh! I get the Paladin Shield! I love the Paladin Shield. I never actually get to use the Paladin Shield because, you know, all it does is it increase your defense and all that fun stuff. Ooh, man. I'd completely forgotten about Paladins. Unless they are down where they are. You again! Nope, 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 nope. Can't handle you. Nope, 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 nope. Well, that only mildly ruins my plan. I mean, I've already got his shield. Can't use his hammer. Well, I could use his hammer, but again, that mitigates the whole... Oh, I'm playing this with the yo-yo. Alright. Come up here. Where'd you come from? Where'd you come from? That was so unfair. Where the hell did you come from? You just appeared. That was so not cool. You cheater. Oh, that horrible cheater. Yeah, I saw that, right? Dude just appeared. Paladins aren't supposed to cheat. Oh my god, this place is infested with paladins. I am legitimately scared for my life. Well, I don't know how the hell that one happened. Oh, you could have at least dropped something of significant amount of value. Alright. These giant curse skulls like to shoot stuff at you. God, this is going to be freaking Darius versus the Paladins, ain't it? Oh my god! Another one! Another one! Ooh. Nope. That's a bad Paladin. drop a significant amount of money or something. They made this place significantly more dangerous. Like, I am not kidding how much danger there is in this place compared to previous editions. Oh my! Where the... Where'd you come from? 
There are so many more paladins! I cannot believe the number of paladins I am facing here. When I was playing the previous edition, I'd be lucky if I could find a paladin. Now there's a paladin every which way. And they just murder me. Hi folks, guess what, not five minutes after I was finished recording last time, not five whole minutes, did I end up getting the Kraken. Five minutes. Five minutes. I, 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 I get... Like really? You bust my nuts, throwing so many paladins at me. And then you don't... Okay. So you'll also notice I have a new set of uh, die this time. This is the Burning Hades die, which I ended up getting from uh, one of the random strange plants that I had found along the way. Five minutes! Oh. So... What we're going to end up doing now, five whole minutes, my God, is we're going to have a talk with Mr. Truffle and see what he's got. He's got the auto hammer, which allows you to build stuff with chlorophyte bars, uh, converting them into shroomite bars. That's nice. Actually, let's put it back in the house. There we go. Now, what can we craft out of this shroomate stuff? Actually, that's a pretty good question. Let's go ahead and convert one bar. Oh no, that's right. We need both chlorophyte and a few glowing mushrooms. And then we can craft a shroomite. Now, what do we do with the shroomite bar? I completely forget. Well, we can make the Shroomite set, which is, like, the best armor that you can make for a ranged person. Uh, something about Shroomite plating. Oh, okay. So, you can make... Whoa. Oh, of course, a lot of stuff. You can make a writable drill mount, which I believe does actually drill. Or you can make some Shroomite digging claws, which is fastest digging claws in the game or you can make yourself a hoverboard you know a la back to the future so you know what i ain't gonna use this room for game never mind i was about to say that i ain't gonna use any more chlorophyte for anything else but then the game said no nope. and then i rem was reminded that i did not actually have that much uh that much of the uh, mushroom variety. So we're going to wait on that. And we are going to find and clear out through other temple. You just gotta give me a moment because I actually have to find the temple. Don't know why I didn't bother doing that before the beginning of this episode. of a long shot could I possibly be missing the temple by? Apparently a lot. Wait. There it is! Oh my god, I found the temple! Woohoo! I found the temple, and now I've got to find the entrance. Oh, nice. Freaking mushroom biome right next to it. Alright. Now I just need to find the damned entrance. It should be close by. They did! They buried the entrance! I passed right by it! Holy crap it! I should be more angry, but I'm just glad that I found the place. This is the jungle temple. 
it is going to be the bane of my existence for approximately the next hour or so. So I'm just going to deposit everything that I need to. Which is going to be that, 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 that. that. I'm just going to straight out discard that. Put that away, that away, that away, that away, that away. Throw away that. Might as well drink that. Ugh. Might as well dispel that. The only reason I'm saving some of this stuff is so I can sell it later, so... Keep that in mind. And that is a lizard dude. A lizard, if you will. He is only the first of many. Ow. Now, what's the danger here? Traps. Every single one of these rooms is going to be layered with traps. All of which are activated by switches. And most of these switches camouflage almost perfectly with the rest of the dungeon. You see that there? That's a trap. That's a trap. Everywhere a trap, trap. Hell, I'm pretty sure that even after deactivating this trap, it'll, you know, make itself into another trap. Oh, see this face? That's a super dark trap. See these? These are spear traps. These ones? Probably another sort of really nasty trap. Holy crap it. This area is just lined with this stuff. Spiky ball traps are freaking nasty, too. And yes, I disarm every single trap in here in case I need to visit it again. Whoa! Whoo! See what I mean? Traps. Everywhere. Now these lizards, if you're not fast enough, well, will actually end up uh, taking a pseudo-second form. I guess you could call it, where they get on their hands and knees and just charge at you with all their might. Graviton potion? Really? At this point in game? And I'm practically able to fly on my own. I don't see why I need no graviton potion. Whew. Yeah, you basically come to a crawl in this game, for this part anyways. All you need to do is be careful, you ain't gonna die. If you, and I have a significantly powerful weapon, so yeah. Loot those. Take those. And again, my freaking yo-yo is pretty damn awesome, so yeah. I ain't taking a lot of damage because I'm giving so much. Oh, hey. Wow. They just cultivated down there while I was busy. Of course, then again, I'm guessing that they've been down here for eons. Ooh, solar tablet. Which means as soon as we get out of here, we can pretty much go on ahead. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Skeletal archers? How oh, they make it down here? Don't know, don't care, as long as they're dead. Alright, there's two up here. I don't think there's any further traps down here that need worry for deactivation. Now, these solar tabs that I'm finding, I can put together, or solar tablet pieces, I can put together to make more solar tablets. Although I don't think I have to worry about solar tablets for a while. More tablet fragments, awesome. Spiky ball traps will, well, they'll do that. And despite its appearance, that ball, that one single ball will do a butt ton of damage. So I rather let it uh, 
Yeah, fade away than anything. Ta. More spear traps. If you're using a, an arena for any of the events, these are the traps that you want to use. Anything else is just not going to work. Or if they will work, they'll just work to a lesser extent, you know? Whew, man. Look at this loot. Most of it is just solar tablet fragments, but at the same time, lizard furnaces. There's a lot of lizard furnaces, actually. Which kind of sucks, seeing as I don't really use a lot of the more weird uh, versions of furniture and the like. Aha! Eat Kraken! Yeah, you see, they'll. When you get them low enough, they'll flip out and they'll do that thing. Oh, looks like I'm finally at the bottom. Boop. That's a new sound. I'm glad they get their own sound. So if I'm silent in the game, concentration. I don't want to get hit by those uh, traps. Well, it's not bad. Personal record for uh, not getting hit by the traps so far. I think the... Despite how cautious I usually am, I still usually end up getting like three traps to the face. Or, you know, wherever else. Look at all these. A little bit of Sucky to be hit by all of those ones. Two traps. Two traps of the face. Right. Keep a look out. I think we're coming to the ceremonial chamber room. Ah, freaking za. Now, all we really need in this chamber is to just... Oh, hey, yay, a meteorite landed? I haven't destroyed a heart in so long, though. Hmm. Now, with the layout of this room, it's going to be sick. Ow! Missed some. Well, it's about par for me for being hit by these traps but the good news is, is that other monsters get uh, other monsters and things get hit by the traps as well so ain't a loss who all right so I'm gonna cut the video here and next time when I start up start recording we shall face off against the golem or maybe I'll just splice the golem into this part. I don't know. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.